Nice. So um, I've been away from the channel for a little while now. Have my appendix out and such. Yeah, bit of glue and stuff still on there. And I uh, haven't been doing much filming obviously because there's not much to do with the whole isolation down. But without much further ado, we're gonna get into the unboxing. Amidst all this coronavirus isolation and that, I've um, and my struggles. I've done some consumer therapy and I bought a deck kit. I went online and I bought a uh, Santa Cruz board. So I wanted a board that's sort of um, good for cruising because around here and in the UK in general the, the, floors, the floors are crap. They're awful. It's hot in here. It's hot in here for me man. Getting through this. So this arrived today. Here we go. Let's have a little look. Are you ready? Yeah. Oh, I got like this. I'm pretty fragile at the moment. Okay, you ready? Are you ready, Carly? I'm ready. <laughs> wow. Look at that baby. It's pretty big. Is it like... We'll slide this out the way for a second. Excuse my hole in my trackies. I'm not too sure how long it is because it didn't really describe too much. Okay, 32 inches, so that's not too bad. So, um, yeah, smaller than your average longboard. It's pretty cool, bag. Yeah. Flip it over for you. So, so, so it is Photo Ops uh, Santa Cruz edition. I think this was the last one that I bought. I don't think there's any left. Um, this one is by Eric Winkowski. Winkowski. I don't really know who that is. I just really liked the photo. It's probably his dog. But I like to pretend it's mine. <laughs> yeah, it's got his name at the bottom there. Um, Matt finish, Santa Cruz at the bottom, and some nice little uh, decal on the side. So yeah, there's not much else to say about this. Let's um, get this off. Is that a sticker there, Carly? Do you want that? Mm, I don't know where I'd put it. I haven't got anything on me. It smells nice. It did come with grip tape as well, thankfully. I'm gonna have to put that on later. Just normal black. Put it over the top, easy. Which is a bit of a shame because that decal there is really nice and I like the black paint on it, but a bit more important that I don't fall off and my feet stay on the board. So. Now, the parts that make it more just a piece of wood. So I bought in two pieces like an idiot. Okay, so we'll pull this out. Got any idea what's in this bag, Carly? Trucks, wheels. Correct. Independent, they're quite a good brand. Independent uh, logo there. It told me that I needed to buy extra bushings because it was going to come with them. <laughs> so I've got another set here, so I could have saved myself some money there. That's a, a bit of a kick to the appendix. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm really hoping this is going to fit because I looked online. Now I'm looking at it, it's looking a bit small, but. I followed a guide, 55mm, these are, just get that on the camera, let's have a nice little look at it. So yeah, I've got a spare pair of bushings now, so yeah, that's, that's that, I like this colour a lot as well, East London, yeah, it's got the address on there, I don't know if that's an actual shop you can visit, but that's that there, oh, they got one in Covent Garden as well, which isn't that far away, I might have to go check that out, ah, hello Jenny. Roadman's arrived. It's quite wide. Yeah, it's well, it's a, it's a cruiser deck. Not really for tricks in there. Well, it's got double kicks. So yeah. It's got rear kick, front kick. Yeah, yeah it's going to take me a, another. So I've been out of hospital, hospital for two weeks. So I've got to wait another two weeks apparently before I can actually ride that sucker. Dude, hey, do you want a sticker? Yeah. Hell yeah. Some stickers. Sticker for you. Sticker for you. Thank you. Slam City Skates. We've gone well off track here. We've got some pink slime ball wheels. They're pretty cool. Yeah, I mean, like, I really like the colour pink. Got another sticker on there. We love our stickers. Yeah, pretty cool. So these are 78A, so they are quite soft, quite squishy. Got a nice bit of squeeze to them there. Bit 
bounce. They are 60 millimeter. I was trying to keep them a bit small so I can still get a bit of tricks in there, but yeah, quite nice. So yeah, I really like the color of that. I don't know how well it's gonna go at the bottom of the board. Not very well. Finally, for uh, bearings, I've just got some standard bone reds. You know, always come in handy, always done me well. Just nice red bearings. Yeah, sweet. So, I guess we'll go take this outside, Carly, and um, go put it together. Oh, we've got to put shoes on then. What I've done, I've made a mistake, is where I haven't bought the bolts that will actually attach on here, but the sizing's right. I can see, yeah, I can see that the trucks are lined up nicely. I'm a bit concerned for wheel bite. Yeah, see, so six, 60 millimeters, so it should be okay. There's a little bit of space. We'll construct the rest tomorrow, what I guess. the void cost you overall? Uh, so far, I've spent about 165 pounds ish That's yeah it's not too bad considering well yeah it's going to be a little while before i can actually use it so so you, you can see me do some kick dips on it before you know how to i'm actually going to stand on it down here so it's got a little bit of a concave which is quite nice and the double kicks so i should be able to uh, get a nice pop on it either end slightly symmetrical see from the side angle there's a nice bit of concave and a bit of a dip it's a nice size definitely yeah i really like the size stand on it if you want no, it's going to get messy anyways the, the stance of it. it's a nice it's a nice natural stance for our height yeah it's a nice tic tac for now because everything's right there in it you're right on the kick tail yeah. welcome to the future i've got the uh Parts delivered, and I've got to say that Slam City Skates are really good. I ordered this last night. What time did it arrive, Judy? Oh, like 10 o'clock or something? Yeah, 10 o'clock in the morning I got it, so. Here we have the grip tape. This tape is going to be clear so I can enjoy the uh, decal on the front. So this is 9 inch grip tape, so I shouldn't need to cut around the edges, so it might be a bit difficult. We'll get to that in a moment. Even more stickers. Any of my friends watching this want a Slam City skate sticker? Get this open book. No, I've got the actual bolts to put the independent trucks on. Uh, yeah, I should have bought these originally, I was unaware that the trucks weren't going to come with it. So that's something to note for the future. And I've got the spacers that go in between the bearings inside the wheel. Okay, let's get started on this then. I try keeping it a bit flush so yeah this is a bit funny where it kind of thins out along this edge here. Comes up. Maybe I should have tried cutting it out. Yeah I'm kind of butchering this grip tape job but I'm not too fussed. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and rag this board as much as I can. Okay, so I finished the grip tape pie thing. I'll be the first to admit it's not a very good job that I've done. But uh, I've never claimed to be an expert. But what I do claim to be is uh, having fun. You can see on the corners, it's not so great. Um, especially on this side. So I overhung just a tiny bit and it was a real pain trying to get it so that it would cut because you see there wasn't so much excess that I could hold on to and get a nice clean cut. It was like a millimetre hanging over and I've kind of done a bit of a hat job in some of it but you know this board's gonna go for a lot harder times than what I've just put it through. So overall I'm not too upset to be honest. I mean like I said I'm having fun and it looks quite cool with the uh, clear tape rather than the black tape that I was gonna go for originally. A little bit. There she goes. Screws free. Trucks on the white, the right way around. Man, I'm sweating out here, it's like 20 degrees today. In the UK, that's hot. Down to the last screw. And the second truck. Trucks are attached. Grip tape. 
although not pretty, attached. Scratched some of the bolts up, unfortunately. Yeah, so I've got independent trucks, independent bolts and screws, and a Santa Cruz deck so far. Snug, got the spacers that I had to order separately. So I'm unaware, I just didn't think, I guess. Spin very nicely just yet because I need to break the bearings and the bushings in. But yeah, it's coming together nicely. I really like this colour. And that is the board complete. Scale there, you can see that it's about the size of a cat. Stretch the tail out. You like the board? Yeah, they're not a dog, huh? <sighs> so that's the board complete. Uh, I got a lot of air bubbles, as Carly just pointed out as well. Um, I'll sort them out another time. The Eric Winkowski uh, photo opportunity, Santa Cruz there. Pink slime balls, 60mm, 78A. Hardness, independent trucks, independent bolts and nuts that I had to buy additionally, and the spacers. So, if anyone that's not really into boards and wants to try build their own in this quarantine where you have a bit of excess money and nothing else to do, such as myself, I'd highly recommend uh, Slam City Skates. Like, I ordered the uh, trucks and the wheels of Slam City Skates as well as the bearings and the additional bushings that I didn't need. Um, they came really quick. The board I ordered from the Santa Cruz UK website. While well, my wound's still healing and in about two weeks time when I'm allowed to skate, I'll uh, take it out for a video. Okay, so my GoPro just died. But I am getting a bit of wheel bite, I reckon. But other than that, I'm really looking forward to riding this board. So, yeah, without much further to say, um, thank you for watching the video and uh, stay tuned for when I get to do something with it. Adios.